Coach, practice number three, and right off the bat, your first day in shells. Well, I mean, it's just good to get shells on. You do a lot more in shells. I mean, we can thud up, butt up, and uh, keep people off the ground, but get some good blocking and tackling, a lot more than you do in shorts. So more, a lot more conducive to the way we play the game. So uh, see some good things back to a hard day, long day. So, I mean, we – we did hit a wall, but we went a little further than we did uh, the other day. So um, hopefully we'll just keep progressing that way and uh, just going hard. You've really stressed recovery here lately. How did yesterday's shorter practice carry over in today's long practice? It allowed us to have the practice we had today. I think if we wouldn't have done that yesterday, probably wouldn't have got it in. So hopefully we'll build tolerance up when we go a little longer in those short days and, uh, and continue with these, these harder, longer days. So uh, I thought the recovery helped a lot. You know, we'll get that done today as well. And obviously today you went a little longer than what the schedule had, but compared to day one, did you see an improvement in the guys' overall recovery and how they their stamina? We really did. I mean, we're not having just a, huge, a lot of soft tissue stuff. We're starting to have a little bit of that creep up, and when you do, you try to dial back a little bit to prevent, um, you know, some of those pulled hamstrings, pulled growings, you know, things like that. And that's kind of what happens. It's not, you know, the, the guy's tolerance is just not there, and it's about recovery. I mean, is the guy, you know, gain his weight back? Is he eating right and uh, staying hydrated? Because if you have soft tissue stuff, it's a hydration issue and a recovery deal. So hopefully the guys will get in um, a routine of doing a good job. And all those bodies are different. You know, we, we've been really good over the years, and knock on wood, not had any, um, you know, heat exhaustion stuff. But that's where your heat exhaustion, soft tissue stuff comes from. So hopefully we'll be able to. Uh, you know, stay uh, stay away from that stuff. It's hot out here, though. Y'all know that. I mean, it's just uh, it's hot out here today, so I'm glad we're going in the mornings as well. You'll go a little lighter tonight in the weight room. What does the weekend look like going into it? We'll keep the same schedule, you know, so we'll be your first day in pads is, you know, Sunday, so we'll get out and knock around a little bit, and tomorrow will be a little bit of a lighter day, but in chill, so you'll be able to get some good work done, and, um, you know, like I said, it's just 24-7 football right now, so uh, they're getting – getting used to it. And those freshmen kind of in culture shock, you know, because they hadn't ever done it this way. So I told them, I said, at least it's a, a shorter camp than it's ever been. We ain't got but like 10 days of camp and uh, hopefully, uh, you know, we'll get into school and, you know, can uh, get ready to play a game.